On our way to Vermezi, our new home. We're at the airport at Pemba, which is right in the north of Mozambique. And we're about to get on a small plane. We've got about an hour flight north up towards the border of Tanzania uh, into the Karimbas archipelago. There's uh, about 32 islands of the Karimbas. And our home is on Vermezi, which is, in my opinion, one of the most beautiful. And, uh, Put camera two over here with me and uh, very excited. Welcome to Vermezi Island. Vermezi Island is one of the most northern islands in the Karimbas archipelago in the north of Mozambique. Vermezi is a sanctuary and is surrounded by some of the most pristine and beautiful coral reefs you can find in the world. Um, next to her is an island called Matundu, which has this incredible wall that runs for a couple kilometers. Huge sheer drop off um, top of the walls at 10 meters, bottom of the walls at about 30, 40 meters, and it drops straight down to 150 to 200 meters. Of course, on Matunda Wall, you have one of the best dive sites in the world called Neptunes. Incredible dive site where a big piece of the wall is broken off. Uh, you've got a big canyon. It's a, it's a cleaning station for gray reef sharks. There's lots of big potato bass, brindle bass, an array of fish. In the blue, you get many, many things like wahoo, dogtooth, tuna, marlin, sailfish. A uh, certain time of the year, you have lots of whales coming past Vermezi, so we'll go be checking some of those out. Vermezi is also special and it's one of the few places in the world where you have mass spawning of coral, where all your coral species spawn on the same night. The reefs are so healthy, are full of beautiful tropical fish. Of course, one of the highlights of Vermezi is the green turtles. We'll be going out, finding turtles, tagging them, watching them dig their nests, watching them lay their eggs. Two months later, watching the babies go back into the sea. Of course, on the land, we have uh, some mango monkeys. We have the awesome coconut crabs. Uh, we have some big pythons, some vine snakes. The real joy is in the water and we'll be doing some scuba diving, some spear fishing, cooking up some nice fresh food. And what a privilege to be living on an island like this.
first first drift on Matunda Canyon. He's shot a nice dog tooth tuna. Giving us a nice fight. Let's see if we can get him up. Okay, this doggy is still on. We're just trying to keep him away from the wall here. Uh, but putting on a good fight.
I slept all night on a big white ship. Seagulls were dancing all around. I woke up with a sunrise on the sea. Such a precious gift to me. The salty breeze and the waves. The slow pace. The salty breeze. I'm um, lucky to be spending the night with uh, my mate Cordoza. Cordoza works for the community project here on Vermezi, the Turtle Conservation Community Project. So basically that's what we're looking for, but obviously with a big fat turtle at the end of it. Cordoza, this is a, a nest from the other day? Two days ago, you say? You can see she came up here, dug her nest. I will make some nests, so but they are no nests. I've been filming green turtles all around the world on some of my diving expeditions. Uh, Ascension Island on the beaches of Ascension Island a little while ago. Oh, incredible. All by myself for two nights on the beach with up to 80 turtles digging nests around me. Got in the water, got some beautiful footage of them resting during the day. Got some nice drone footage of them mating from the air. And of course that beautiful big fat green turtle that came and tried to bite my camera. My friend Fawaz was filming me. Got some awesome shots. I've also filmed the green turtles up on the northern tip of Madagascar on the feeding on the turtle grass. But now once again, I'm chasing these beautiful green turtles down on the east coast of Africa and Mozambique. So the guys have found us a, a turtle, Makati. She is. Wow, look at that. Looks like she started to lay already. So what's the procedure? How long does it normally take to dig the nest? Uh, the normal is the, the, the take to for all process it, taking four hours. Four hours in total? Yes, in total. Wow. That's incredible. This is an amazing place to be, lying here on the beach. Yeah. Beautiful evening. You can see this girl is right up against the grass. Look at these logs over here. She's literally dug herself under these logs. Found herself a little nest. Well done, girl. Okay, so the guys also take a GPS reading. The exact location of the nest. And then you know where the nest is when the turtles come out, eh? Yeah. How long is it before the turtles normally hatch? Two months. Two months, eh? Okay, so two months and there'll be some little critters coming out of here. You can see she's really working hard to cover up this nest now, digging into the bank and all those trees. She'll slowly twist and twist and turn. Eventually she'll cover up completely and she'll head out towards the ocean. Flippers are pretty tough by the looks of it. Whoop, covered us in sand. Whoop! <laughs> Trying to bury me alive here. The turtle's just covering up her nest and she's gonna head back into the water soon. Yeah. Thank you very much to Cordoza and okay, Makati. <laughs> well done, guys. It's yeah, been an it's unbelievable nice evening. Enough. We found a green turtle. We watched her dig her nest. We watched her lay her eggs. And I'm sure they're going to see her going back into the water. But these guys have got to head off. Yeah. Um, I'm going to head back to bed soon. They've got the whole night on the beach to repeat it. And hopefully you find some more. Yes, the other side beaches, uh, Lodge Beach. From us here at uh, 1 o'clock in the morning on Vermezi Island. We'll check you next time.